walking through the stage, the hilarious, the funny, you hear him every morning. You know what I'm saying? He wake up on the Ricky Smiley morning show. Mr. Special K. <laughs> Brothers and sisters that's looking good and struggling. You look like you're doing good, but you're struggling. Don't feel bad. I'm with you. I come from a long line of struggle. I struggle better than anybody I know. I come from a long line of struggle. My parents struggled. My mother struggled when I was a baby. She struggled when I was a teenager. She's struggling now. My mama was eligible for every government program they had. She signed up for it and got all of it. She's still collecting wick for me to this day. I said, Mom, I'm a grown man with kids and a wife of my own. She said, How you still collecting wick? She talking about, Well, you still my baby. I said, You know what? You're going to jail. You're going to jail messing with them folks. You know your life bad when you do all your shopping at the dollar store like it's a real store. It's like, as a grown person, you really should be ashamed of yourself. Like, you ever bought a whole bunch of stuff out of the dollar store and drive down the street and see the 99 cent store and be mad? <laughs> you like, God, dog, I could have waited. I could have got all this for less. <laughs> the dollar store, not black, but we got the dollar store thing and they're a real store now. You go in there now, they got stuff that ain't got no business being a dollar. <laughs> I, I'm in there yesterday, I'm like, man, y'all got king size company sets for real? One dollar? Twelve pieces? One dollar, brother. You can't buy everything at the dollar store, though, man. Some stuff you need to pay for, for real. Pay full price. Don't be, hey, you can't go cheap on everything. You can't buy your dishwasher liquid at the dollar store. You get home and be mad, you gotta put a half a bottle in your water to get four bottles. You gotta bought some batteries at the dollar store and get home and your remote still don't work. You mashing and mashing. Don't be mad at them. You bought 88 AA batteries for a dollar. What you expect? You bought a whole bucket of batteries for one dollar. You gonna get mad. That's your fault. You ain't supposed to buy that stuff out the dollar store. I've been seeing women. I've been seeing women going in there with your little trifling self buying pregnancy tests out the dollar store. How awful is that? You buy You really pregnant? You ain't willing to invest but one dollar? Man, I, I still live in the hood. People, you know, people hear you on the radio, they think you're doing a bit. I still live in the hood. I still gotta deal with hood things like uh ghetto fast food restaurants, which makes me man, ain't nothing worse than a ghetto McDonald's that ain't nothing like the McDonald's on the commercial. People ain't got their whole uniform on. Like ain't nobody got a hat, a name tag, or nothing like that. How you little McDonald's pants with an auto zone shirt, play? I'm just. They just do what they want to do to get them, McDonald's. You know, people behind the counter don't even work there. Who are they, who are that baby back there by the uh, fry machine with a diaper and no shoes on? You go to get them, McDonald's, they're running out of stuff they supposed to have. How y'all ain't got stuff you supposed to have? We ain't got no cheese, we all out of onion. Come on, man. I ordered a quarter pound of cheese, they brought it out on plain white bread. I said, what's going so what sets me see bun at, man? We ran out of them bun two weeks ago, player. We just trying to keep it moving, player. We just trying to keep it. You can't do that. And then they run out of stuff they supposed to have. You ask for some, you, 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 you ask for one thing, they run out of stuff they supposed to have. They offer you some other item that ain't got nothing to do with the thing you asked for. Now, who started this? I don't know who authorized this. I asked for extra ketchup in my bag. Dude gonna look me right in the face, man. We ain't got no ketchup. We got grape jelly, though. in the same family, dog. Like, <laughs> drive through the ghetto McDonald's is a disaster. Oh, it's, it's, it's the worst. You know what I mean? they, do, they do what they want to do, I'm telling you. You got to check your bag before you pull off from that window, player. Check your bag, make sure it's right. Because not only will they mess it up, they have stuff in your bag that McDonald's don't even sell. <laughs> I look at my bag, I got a carton of shrimp fried rice and some... <laughs> Man, I ain't charge you for that, don't worry. I said, man. <laughs> that ain't even the point. <laughs> Only 
one place that, the only, the only thing I like about living in the hood is a Walmart everywhere. And I go to Walmart every single day. I don't know about y'all. I go to Walmart every day. I swear, I, I, man, I love Walmart more than anything in the world. That is the greatest retail operation in the history. Man, them prices, you can't beat them prices. You deal with any of the other mess in Walmart because of them prices. I, and you know I ain't lying. Man, I get so excited when I go to Walmart and look at them prices. I be losing my mind. I go in there, man. I, I be calling my own boy at 3 in the morning. Hey, man, wake up. No, you ain't going to believe this. They got iron in boys for 88 cents. I'm talking about 12 of them and sell them at the barbershop. I swear I am. I love Walmart. And you go to Walmart, you can't never get the one thing you went in there to get without getting something extra, right? I challenge you to go in there and get one thing. My wife went in there to get a, a, a birthday card that came out with a silly band and two mountain bikes. Really, rap bikes. I'm like, are you serious? But you can't resist them prices, man. You cannot beat them. Because they know how to do it. They know that that 99 is a deal breaker. When they put that 99 at the end of that price, that's a deal breaker. Come on now, if another store got a microwave, Target got a microwave for $69.99, but in your mind, you know Walmart got that same microwave for $69.33? You drive an hour and a half, I should wait to say that. To say that little change. But Walmart know how to do it, man. They know how to put them prices where you can't resist. 518. 37, 212. Come on, man. 212? That's the best price in the world. I buy anything for 212. I could, I could be a Muslim and they got ham slices for 212. I'm buying them. Walmart take care of all your shop needs in one trip. You ain't got to go nowhere else. Am I lying? You ain't got to go nowhere. Go in there with your money right. You ain't got to go nowhere else. Where else can you go? Get you a dining room table, a laptop computer, some shower curtains, a TV set. Drop your car, get your tires rotated, your oil changed. Grab some groceries for the house, diapers for the baby, clothes for the kids. Pick up your prescription, get your eyes checked. Stop by the hair salon, get you a washing set. Stop by the nail shop, get some free tips on your nails. A pedicure on your feet. Stop by the bank, cash your check, sit off a money order, pick up a Western Union. Do your taxes, pay your light bill. And grab some McDonald's or Subway on the way up. Let's play Big Bank, take Love Bank. bank you bank, are looking bank. at a shark and a fish tank. tank, tank when, I'm in the kitchen, when I'm in the kitchen, I make plenty of cash. Cash, cash shorty, calm milk. She got plenty.